guys, this is JR Cuban, and as you can see, I have three sc scrambled egg meats so in front of me, and today I'll be doing some more uh, egg meats example salts. So this here was suggested by uh, Oxowalkie, I'll be linking his channel in just the description. As you know, I have other example salts on my channel, but they're not that good, and there's like really loud, loud noises in the background. But now that I'm moved houses, I thought it would be better if I upgrade that video and do another one in which I won't have as much noise or anything in the background and I'll be able to concentrate more onto my salts and stuff. So just like last time, I'm going to be doing two example salts on white slash black and one on purple because that's how I solve. And um, I'll just be showing my thought process and what I do and what I had did through white and um, my just basically how I put the thing in the middle in the middle of the soul and what I would see, what do I do, how I would execute things. So currently I average around well, one minute to sub one. I have plenty of sub one averages at home and I have a really good sub one single at officially and um, a one or three average officially. I hope I can break that down. But I think I can help out people that are, are trying to break that sub 1 barrier or average like sub 105. And I think maybe I can show my thought process on how I solve. And um, if that will help you out at all. Alright, I'm gonna set these two off to the side. Get right into the first example solve. So in this, I see that my star pieces are here, 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 and the blue one's right here. So what I would do, I will leave these two right here for now, and then I will move this green over here. Then I will move this red down, do a sort of like F prime move. Insert this piece, then insert the red, then insert these two. Then for my first pair, it may take me a bit, I would see these two, and then I'll be also trying to look ahead to these two. I'll go ahead and solve this pair while I can, and insert it first since it's right here. Now I enter this one. Next one, I saw this green and then this piece right here. So I'll move this over here. Then insert it. Next one, I would move this up here with this blue red piece. Gonna just do an R2. Insert it. Then we'll just beat these two last. So for my first space, I remember I always did cream first and then always end up on pink. So I see this giant block right here. So what I would do is and also see this piece. This is honestly very good. I would move this over and insert it like that, then do this. Then I would see these two and I will easily break them up. Then I will enter this piece. That will push this out, but that will be fine. Then I will enter this on uh, these this pair and do a F prime. Then I see this that goes with here. That goes with this. Then I will see I can just easily pair it up while looking ahead to this pair. And then insert this and easily doing this case. Then I'll move this corner up, and then the edge that goes with this corner is back here. So I do a sort of beachy move, and then connect it and insert the pieces. I will then insert these two, do a sort of move like that to connect these two, and then enter it like that. I can't do double flex with my lefty finger, so I always do a push move. 
I then see that this is already solved, so I just easily enter this like that. And then for this, I would probably do a U2, R2 to insert in this pink red piece. Then I would do something like this to pair this up, R2. I would then see this pair. But I may see this pair first. I'll probably go for this pair since it's easy piece like that. And then I'll just insert a sword like this. Then I'll just do this last pair. Canceling into a slash or to orient more edges. And this is a pillow that I know is just a sort of wide move. Uh, sort of like this pillow on 3x3. Three three. So I do it like this. And then I will orient all these, move across and these move across. So I do the out that for that. And then just CP. So on to the next solve. So in this scramble, I see this, these pieces. Uh, and the green one is back here and I also see that this F2 pair is solved and that this one can be easily solved doing the F2 case. So what do I do? There's a lot going on in this. I would most likely do I would move this piece over so I can install it adjacent, well not adjacent but next to this one. So I do YouTube Prime then for this, I would move this over so I can solve this next to this. Move the crossover, insert that piece, then do this last. So for first F2 pair, I will go ahead and solve this. And if you can see, this can be solved back here. So after I finish doing this pair, I'll be going straight into this. And I'll move it back so I can easily do an easy setup case. Now we'll do this pair, then this pair, but go ahead and do this one while I've seen it. And I also see that this and this will be, oh, I'll have to solve that after this, and this will be easy by the uh, edge and stuff, so I'll do this. Then lastly, solve this pair. sooner back soon then for this I would do a 
J perm and try to trace these edges. I see the not a J perm, Y perm. The Y this piece will go here, so that will be solved. This one goes here. And this one goes here. So it's gonna be the Olo that goes like this. I mean the Pilo and go right to this. So on to my last solve, and this one will be on purple. So this should go by a tiny bit faster than the last solves. So what I see is this, this giant block. Oh, this one, this one, and this yellow. So what do I do? I would do this first, insert in the yellow, the white, move this over, then insert this in. Then I would remember these and try to look for this edge and the edge is right here. So I try to do something like this. And, and then I'll insert in this edge. It's pretty inefficient, but make an easy X star. Then I'll first do these two. Yeah, same these two while I was doing that pair. And then I would do most likely this one because I believe this is yellow and that is correct. Then I'll see this one and try to track it. Go straight into that pair. Solve it like that. And then this one, this pair is already made so I'll go straight into that. I think I would take advantage of this and this while I can. So I do this. And then I would solve this pair. But I ended up breaking this one, so I do something like this. F prime R U2 R prime U F. Then I'll solve this pair and then just go straight to this pair right afterwards. Then this. I saw this edge down here. Then I'll go straight to this. That rotation. And then this pairs up with this. So I'll do something like this. Then entering this edge also. Those extra moves. Yeah, I'll do something like this. Just set up these two. I saw these two pairs, so I'll do something like that. And set them up. Then for the last pair, I would do this. Now, in this case, I do not know. There's one on Olo that's similar to this. You just do the sword W case, but this is not oriented, so I can't do that. So I just do this, do two look, and try to possibly see if I get any edges solved. And it looks like this one's going to be solved and possibly this one's going to be solved adjacent to it. And that was correct. Do a J prime. Right to this. So yeah, I hope you found these example solves really helpful and better quality than my last example solves. And if you do, please uh, say that this is better or say something in a comment that lets me know that this was better than my last example solve and also we're about to hit 100 subscribers so if you could suggest something i just don't know what to do anymore i may uh do maybe a two through seven this time instead of a two through six since i have a seven by seven and average actually decent on it so i may do something like that and uh yeah if you enjoyed this video please like and subscribe and uh i will have more content now in the future i'm thinking about getting some new cubes, possibly, possibly the Mr. M, because I've heard that that's really good, the Mr. Mr. M Pure, and so there that's that just came out of the cubicle, but yeah, that's some possibilities, so I'll have those, and uh, I may or may not get them, if I do, you'll just see the unboxing video, and I'll just continue on from there, so yeah, if you enjoyed this content, please like and subscribe, and turn the post notifications on, because I'll have more videos out in the future. And this is Joe Cuban, signing out.